I will get, well, begin to swear you in. Do you swear or affirm? Mr. Acting Secretary, why was a child of eight months held for six months while his dad was deported two months later? When we implemented the zero tolerance protocols uh, to increase prosecution of amenable adults, including those arriving with children, I specifically directed, and the Chief of the Border Patrol echoed, that that would not include parents traveling with children under five. So when we've gone back and looked at the cases, and there were a few dozen uh, of separations during that time frame, uh, we've determined that there were other reasons that would comply with the current executive order or court order for separations of children under five that occurred during the zero tolerance period. We hear about stories coming out from you and your agency that everything is pretty good and you're doing a great job. I guess you, you feel like you're doing a great job, right? Is we're, that what you're saying? We're doing our level best in a very... What does that mean? What does that mean when a child is sitting in their own feces? Can't take a shower. Come on, man. What's that about? None of us would have our children in that position. They are human beings. What's wrong with Flores that everybody keeps saying they want to change Flores? Just a single provision. You want to keep wanna, kids longer. No, we don't want to change you those provisions kids about longer, Mr. conditions Secretary. in our custody. You want to codify those provisions. No, you want to keep kids the longer. It's been standard. very clear from this administration. You want to kids keep kids longer. We want to keep families together through an immigration proceeding by that's keeping fair kids and expeditious longer. in an appropriate setting. That can't be done in 20 days with due process. That's right. So just admit that, though. Tell people it's not you want to keep the conditions, but you want to keep the kids longer. We want to keep very high standards. And we're willing to have a conversation about how high those standards should and can be. Yeah. But we need to be able to finish immigration proceedings before people are released. Otherwise, we don't have an effective result. Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.